Yo, this is comedian Rob Coleman coming at you with another trailer review. Now today, 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 we're going to do something a little different that I haven't done before since I've been uh, doing these trailer reviews. We are actually going to review the trailer of a movie that I've already seen. Now, I've seen the movie, but I've never actually seen the trailer for this movie. I saw reviews for this movie uh, last year sometime, and fans were just losing their mind talking about how good this movie was, right? Um, it was all over uh, social media, internet, all over like different websites that this was a great movie. And I had a chance to check it out on Shudder. And let me tell you, I was blown away. This was one of the most fun, gory horror movies I've ever seen. Um, it, it was a, a ton of thrills and surprises. It puts its foot on the gas about 15 minutes into the movie and just doesn't let up. And it's just filled with just different shocks and turns and twists that you will not see coming, right? <laughs> uh, I, I don't want to give too much away because this is such a great movie. You should experience yourself. And here is the movie that I'm referring to. We are talking about When Evil Lurks. Now, like I said, when this movie came out, it was a ton of fanfare about it. It won a ton of awards um, at different uh, movie festivals. And everybody was just raving about this movie. And when I actually saw it, I totally agreed with them. But I was so hungry to see the movie, I never actually checked the trailer out. Now, what's the deal with this movie? Well, this movie is directed by um, South American uh, director uh, Damon Rugna. Damon Rugna. And he's actually responsible for another really good horror movie classic. And let me just say this. I feel like the South American or Latino horror movies don't get their just due. We're always talking about like J-horror or horror movies out of Japan or or um, uh, Korean horror movies or um, back in the day, it was a lot of uh, French horror movies, uh, those gallo sort of slasher movies. You know, everybody like talked about movies from those countries. I feel like we don't talk about these South American uh, horror movies enough. These movies are great. I've seen a few of them. And um, the other movie uh, that this uh, director made uh, was called Terrified. In, in the States, it's called Terrified. Um, I believe in uh, South America and where it was released is called Alcarados. I know I'm not pronouncing that correctly, so I'm not, I don't speak Spanish. So please forgive me if I'm like totally slaughtering that name. But uh, let me show you guys uh, the cover for that one. Um, so if you, if this one comes across the stream and you get a chance to check it out, uh, this one is just, just as good, if not uh, better uh, than uh, when evil lurks. Um, Let's go ahead and uh, show you the screen for this one. Now, if you're a, a big horror movie fan, that's great. Just know that sometimes with some of these movies, <laughs> they are subtitled. So you are going to have to do some reading in between the scares. <laughs> so just just be aware, you know, uh, these are not uh, English dub movies. A lot of times these are subtitled. Uh, so uh, just be aware of that fact uh, when Evil Lurks is actually subtitled. And this is the other movie that that director made, Damon Ragna. Uh, once again, highly uh, reviewed, uh, really high marks on IMBD, uh, Rotten Tomatoes. And uh, if you get a chance to run across this one, definitely check this one out as well. It's uh, called Terrified in the States. Um, so what's the synopsis of this movie? Well, this particular movie uh, is about uh, two brothers. Let me just actually read it from you from the uh, IMBD because uh, they kind of sum it up pretty well. Um, the IMBD uh, summary says that two brothers in a remote village find a demon infected man just about to give birth to evil itself. They decide to get rid of the body only to end up unintentionally spreading chaos. Now, that's a nice, simple review that does not give this movie justice. This movie, like I said, is just full of surprises, um, a good amount of gore, a good amount of shocks, a uh, good amount of uh, jump scares, like literally everything that you want in a horror movie. So I, without giving too much away, um, definitely make sure to check this one out. If you don't have a, a shutter description, make sure to get one and make this one of the first movies that you watch. Um, now, let's actually take a look at this trailer. Now, uh, just real quick, the movie stars a couple of uh, 
South American and um, Latino actors and actresses that I'm not familiar with. They have worked with this director before. Uh, Ezekiel Rodriguez uh, comes in as the uh, male, um, you know, as, as the uh, star. Uh, Damon Solomon, I uh, believe, is the brother, and Savinia Sabatur uh, are listed as, you know, top billed as the top three uh, stars of this movie. But this movie has, you know, several other people in it. Like I said, check it out uh, for yourself to uh, see the full cast and crew. Um, now, let's actually take a look at the actual trailer for this movie. Because, like I said, I have not seen the trailer myself. Um, I was tempted to watch it uh, just to make sure that it was good before I presented it, you know, here on the page. But you know what? Um, what's life without, you know, a few surprises? So, <laughs> so let's take a look at this trailer real quick. Um, see what it looks like and uh, see if this is something you guys should be uh, checking out. I love this movie, like I said, and I hope you guys will, too. Let's see this trailer. <laughs> yeah, that go like what now? en el pueblo estás asustando a mi familia no vi con mis propios ojos estuve con él esto va a ser un infierno ¡No! <risa> yes, tenemos que encontrar a la bestia. Antes de que nazca más. Ah, so good. Los tiempos de la fe se terminan rápido. <risa> Very cool. Very cool. All right, listen. It's hard. Let me tell you guys something. That trailer, while it was pretty good, does not do this movie justice. This movie is really, really good. Um, there's so many other things they could have put in that trailer that happened in this movie that uh, I'm so glad they didn't give away. Um, I, I Listen, I'm telling you guys right now, if you saw that trailer, uh, they didn't give anything away in that trailer. I hate it when a movie trailer comes out and they show you like the scariest moments and you're like, okay, well, what do I have to look forward to now? Why do I have to watch the movie? You just go show me the scariest parts. Not in this trailer. Mm -mm. Nope. There's a, <laughs> there's a whole bunch of parts that, you know, they could have put in this trailer, like I said, to get people to watch it, but that was good enough. If you guys haven't had a chance to see this movie yet, it's been out on um, Shutter for a while. Definitely check it out. Like I said, I haven't seen that trailer before, so that was the first time watching it. The trailer is creepy and it does uh, a lot of good stuff, but see this movie, man. See this movie. You will not be disappointed. Uh, let me know if you guys have seen any other movies uh, that you would like me to check out. Um, I'm going to keep reviewing some trailers. Uh, this was a pretty fun. I might actually go back and maybe look at some trailers for some classic scary movies, some, you know, some old school scary movies and um, see what the trailers used to look like back in the day. I'm having a ball doing this. So if you guys are following me and liking the content and 
um, want me to do some different things or have any other ideas, definitely let me know. Like I said, I am having a ball. I don't care if just one person watches. Uh, I'm having fun and I hope you guys are having fun too. Once again, it's your boy, comedian Rob Coleman coming at you with another scary movie trailer review. Uh, like, share and subscribe. Thank you guys again for watching.